And so at this point, I'd like to call on uh, Dr. Tipa Sanaralingam to present the community oncologist perspective. By way of introduction, uh, Dr. Sanaralingam is a valued colleague that uh, we share a, s a number of patients with in terms of referrals and clinical trials. She is a, a staff oncologist at the Rouge Valley Health uh, System, where she also serves as the medical director of the of the oncology program. She has a very strong interest in teaching and has uh, obtained a academic appointment of the Department of Medicine at the University of Toronto. And her clinical practice includes treatment of a variety of tumor types, but with a special interest in breast and colon cancer. Tipa. Um, so yeah, I'm one of the community oncologists. I work in Scarborough. So uh, as a community oncologist, I, teach, uh, I treat all tumor sites. Um, thank you. Do I just press the green? Press yeah, the green okay, button. thanks. Um, see, I don't, I'm not up here very often because I work in the community, so I don't know how to use this. Um, so um, as a community oncologist, I mean, part of the reason I went out to the community was to give patients the same treatment that they would get at an academic center, but just closer to home. I mean, these patients end up in our eMERGE. And so uh, for me, it was very important to be able to look after them in eMERGE, in the clinic, and sort of uh, throughout their cancer journey. Um, but I think at our center, we also pride ourselves very much on making sure that our patients are getting access to things that the patients at the academic centers would be getting, and that includes uh, access to clinical trials and therapies that we may not be able to deliver in um, our institution itself. 